My name is Kevin Kuschel and these are some of the best free orchestral sample libraries out there. They're so good for writing orchestral music that you'd maybe think they're paid products, but they're completely free. Ideas are not limited by budget. I list all the download links in the description under the video. You're welcome. First up, Spitfire Audio's BBC Symphony Orchestra Discover. This library is a gateway into the world of orchestral music production. You have everything from violins to French horns, percussion, flutes, oboes, everything you could have in the orchestra. You have long and short articulations for all instruments. And for a few instruments, there are like advanced articulations, for example, pizzicados for the strings. BBC's O Discover is perfect for beginners who want to test the waters of orchestral music production without having to go down the rabbit hole of non-stop gassing orchestral sample libraries. It's one thing to have a ton of sample libraries, but it's an entire different beast to know how to write great music with them. If you're interested in that, check out my course Orchestral Music Production for Beginners down in the description below. Next we have Orchestral Tools Layers. With this library, you can easily create full orchestral colors. This is like a one button chord generator, so to say. You have major, minor and sustained chords. In longs and shorts. And different inversions. And I have them in the full orchestra, as you just heard, but also sections like woodwinds, brass, and strings. It's really nice for adding orchestral depth, uh, like below other orchestral instruments that you might have, and uh, you will have more like an illusion of one full and rich orchestra playing. A similar tool to achieve this is Palette Primary Colors by Red Room Audio. This free library gives you full strings, brass and woodwinds ensembles with long sustains and staccato shorts. You have a slider down here for like a tremolo or flat articulation. Really cool. Now while BBC SO Discover and Orchestral Tools layer run in their free proprietary sample players, for primary colors you will need the full version of Contact. Vienna Symphonic Library's Big Bang Orchestra is basically a massive tutti orchestra. So like everything playing together for super quick, large orchestration, though you can play only the full orchestra at once. So there's no section control for like strings, brass or woodwinds. Now for strings, we are blessed with a huge variety of awesome free strings instruments. Gentle Strings is a chamber sized string ensemble playing consordino. So with a mute for a softer sound. has three mic positions and an atmospheric layer for soft cinematic sounds. Absolutely gorgeous. You can change the microphone positions here to make it more close sounding. Or push it further away. And you can dial in the atmosphere layer that gives it more of this cinematic scoring effect. Gender Strings is part of the Blueprint series, a number of great freebies by Fracture Sounds available for the new set of subscribers, and it runs in the free contact player. Go check it out. Next, we have Heaviosity Foundation's Staccato Strings for the free contact player. It's short, crisp staccatos plus an atmospheric sound design layer. It has a great interface with some customization options and a very nice selection of cinematic presets.
feels very premium and I love that we got this level of sampling available for free. Performance samples, full spring or somos picados. Those require contact six full, but you get rewarded with one strings patch of pure joy. You can play short spiccados, perfect for dramatic or epic scoring. You're not artificially limited in the playable range, like in many other sample library demos, and it's very simple to use. Very easy, like all of the performance samples libraries, and I can only recommend this one. It's really good. Next up, performance samples solo violin legato. It's an expressive vibrato solo violin patch, and it was released as an early freebie back then, then taken down and later got re-released in 2022. It's old, but absolute gold. Holy moly. This one you could pay for, in my opinion. There are a few bugs every now and then, like if you re-trigger a note with the sustain pedal. Suddenly it plays like half a tone lower, but I don't care. Like this is so good. The legato is so good and I love that they brought back this freebie. Thank you. The same goes for the solo cello legato, which is a freebie built from unused Pacific recording sessions, a very expensive sample library. So this speaks volume for the quality of this freebie. It's a slurred legato. So unlike the solo violin, now we have like um, not the bow change when you change between notes, but actually the fingers that glide over the over the fingerboard of the instrument. So every note here has the legato transition sort of um, gliding between the notes. Let's take a listen. So you hear a bit of this gliding sound. It has three mic positions and it's absolutely incredible. Next, you probably have some of the best short notes on the market. A demo patch for Fluid Shorts 3 with a full cello section. So the smart thing about this is that it actually has multiple short speeds. So if you play short notes, it sounds just like this. The notes ring out fairly long, but if you play them very fast in succession, you hear that the notes in between, they don't blur into the next one, like they are shortened in a way, they are tighter. This is yeah more snappy and prevents that the notes blur into each other. Very nice. There's also a solo bass and a solo cello patch included. Spitfire Lab strings one and two are really great. They run the free Spitfire player and you have ensemble longs and shorts. You can also dial in the reverb here. In the lap strings too, we have pizzicato, so plucked notes, Bartok pits, where they snap the uh, strings against the fingerboard, and also really nice swells. Check out Frozen Strings and Scary Strings if you like cinematic atmospheric textures. Here's one of the highest quality strings freebie available in my opinion, and that's Stress of Sampling's minimalist violence taken from their premium flagship strings library, Aflatus. Minimalist violence is six violence in a polyphonic true legato patch. It has Divisi, a rare feature in a free sample library patch where it plays only with half of the section size, all separate and real recordings. All six players. And only half of them.
if you're looking for the best of the best in free sample orchestral strings, you have to get Minimalist Violin. If this video is helpful to you so far, I would really appreciate if you could give it a thumbs up. It helps me as a creator and I can grow and make more of this stuff happen. Now, short strings and sordino violins are two great strings instruments from the Free Orchestra by Project Sam. They run in the Free Contact Player. You don't need to buy Contact Full. Short strings are ensemble strings saccados for nice impactful accents. <laughs> And the Sordino strings have warm, lush, muted violins taken from the Symphodia 1 recording. Absolutely gorgeous sound. Heaviosity Foundation, Staccato Brass for the Free Contact Player are short, bombastic shorts. Short shorts. And they have a nice atmospheric sound design layers and cinematic presets as well, just like the strings counterparts for the Foundation's series. They sound like this. And of course, nice cinematic presets like this one. It has a nice interface where you can shape the sound like the attack decays tenant release envelopes. You can gate and arpeggiate your patterns straight away, whatever you want to do, plus cinematic presets. So this one is a real winner. Bolt Legado Brass, also from Project Sam's The Free Orchestra. Bolt Legado Brass is horns and trombones playing together. And one nice feature is that you can set the staccato velocity. So everything, for example, above 100 velocities, so when I press really hard, plays a staccato articulation. Then if I play softer, I play the legato again. Very nice, uh, like a sort of performance patch. I can play nice melodies and then in between switch to the shorts. Heroic Horns is also part of the Free Orchestra 1 by Project Sam. It's an epic eight French horn section that's great for grand heroic themes taken from the Symphobia 2 recordings. It's like this marcato um, articulation in a way. Norland trumpet is often regarded as one of the most realistic uh, instrument freebies out there. It's very playable, has great legato, a modeled vibrato, different articulations, a mute emulation. It's pretty detailed and it can replace a full solo trumpet library if you ever need one. I have bad news for you. Orchestral woodwind freebies are kind of rare. So here's one that's a bit dated, but it's still good. Simple Flute by Fluffy Audio doesn't have a true legato and instead uses a scripted legato engine, but it sounds fairly okay. It has a long and short articulation and it's a good pick if you don't have any other flutes in your arsenal yet and you're looking for a free option. Now the good news is that for ethnic or world woodwinds, there are some amazing freebies out there and I want to show you two of them. Jade Ethnic Orchestra Xiao Freebie. 
This is oh, so good. It's taken from the big Jade Ethnic Orchestra and I love this freebie. Great legato. Beautiful performance. It's a little bit limited in range, but a great Chinese legato flute. The other one, Stress of Sampling's Duduk, taken from the Balkan Ethnic Orchestra, is one of the best free virtual woodwinds, in my opinion, hands down. It's an Armenian ethnic flute, and it sounds like this. This super nice, expressive Eastern European woodwind instrument, it has two key switch areas, one on the right that you just heard to play melodies and on the left you have also like textural ornaments going on. Now let's smack some drums. Performance samples, Pacific Percussion Freebie. You need contact full and what you get in return is a fully functional unlimited percussion freebie for ensemble toms and ensemble taikos, solo bass drum and a tenor drum with tons of dynamic layers, repetition sampling, multiple speed of repetition, triggering based on playing speed, playable rolls and what that means is basically a super lively sound. So you can play it. And it's, it's just ah, very organic, very lively. So these are the individual elements. And together. This is so good, really cool, fantastic, super high quality. Get this one. Thunder Extreme Freebie by Stress of Sampling has low taiko articulations where 15 people smack some taiko drums in a big hall. It uses Stress of Sampling's Extreme engine where you have different zones that you load the instruments in that have like individual microphone control and mixing options over these zones. Really good, very playable, and I think it's a good freebie. Next one is Lapsed Percussion by Spitfire. It's also a good one if you don't have any percussion library yet. It's a little bit less orchestral and more general studio use, I would say. And it also has a drum kit. Orchestral Tools also has a few percussion freebies in their Sign Factory, Dynamo and Gearbox, which are good for this sort of studio percussion and similarly like Labs percussion, they provide you with a good basic palette of percussion instruments, though they're, I think, not really geared towards this big orchestral ensemble style. Still worth mentioning. Now for choir, we have Spitfire Labs Choir. It's a taste of their flagship Eric Whittaker Choir that's recorded in Air Studios, which is very nice. Labs Choir combines three evolutions from that library into one free choir texture. I like it. Sort of swells and has movement. Good for like textual work. Aviosity also has a foundations one for the choir. It's called Emotive Choir, which is good. It has uh, six alto, tenors and six basses singing together. It has, as we expected, the cinematic presets and ways to chop and arpeggiate right away, shape the envelope and add effects like the punch knob for more oomph to it. It's a very good hybrid cinematic scoring library without a price tag.
Luminous Choir from the Free Orchestra, also by Project Sam, is also available for the free contact player. And with that, you get a choir ensemble that's taken from Symphobia 3. Altos, tenors and basses singing together in a crescendo, diminuendo way. So it sort of uh, swells up and then back down. can shape the vowel, I think it's like a formant filter or so. To have a bit of control of like the overall tone of the instruments, of course it's not like, like shifting through this, it doesn't sound very realistic, but it is helpful to have to have like a chance to have it sound more brighter or more mellow so it's also a good option sound paint has a very nice free piano the 1928 steinway vintage piano It has a very nice and warm sound of a very characteristic old piano, and it's lovely. Speaking of warm sound, Spitfire Labs has a soft piano, which is like a felt piano. They put a little piece of felt between the hammers of the piano and the strings that they uh, strike, and it sounds very warm, very cinematic. It's a great piano, very good if you don't have any other felt piano yet. And yeah, it's super nice and cinematic for uplifting, emotional orchestral music, epic music, like for these um, moody intros or outros. If you don't have any felt piano yet, this one is the way to go if you don't want to spend any money. Vienna Symphonic Library also has the piano freebie called Soft Imperial, which is also great. It needs a free iLock account, so you activate the software on your machine, but you don't need like a physical dongle uh, like you used to with the old iLock versions. But yeah, you still need to go that extra authentic authentication step. Um, feel free to give this one also a go, it's good. Now, Stress of Sampling has a jazz orchestra called Diamond, and from that they made a freebie that has three instruments. I particularly like the acoustic bass. And if you press the notes harder, you get these bends. And then you can just play away. Spitfire Audio Labs also has a dulcimer. Which is a niche instrument that you will want to have every now and then when you need it. This one is waiting for you and it's ready to do you good. You have it fingered. But also hammered. Also check out this dude for cinematic dulcimer music. Fracture Sounds has another blueprint that I can recommend, the textural violin for the free contact player. It's taken from their fantastic Trails Evocative Soundscapes library with four articulations. It's part of their blueprint series, so you need to sign up for the Fracture Sounds newsletter and it's totally worth it. Now for hard hitting sound design effects, trailer music and all this hybrid gritty orchestral effects scoring, there is no way around Keep Forest. And they have this nice package of freebies that uh, includes Keep Forest, uh, Devastator Warzone, Iser X, Ryzenge, and Ferrum for hybrid orchestral percussion. This is a great entry into the world of hybrid effects to ramp up the power of your orchestra. They're super high quality and among the best you can get. So these freebies are also quite extensive, I would say, in content. There's a lot of stuff there. Tonal loops.
playables. Also crazy stuff like these gun reloading sounds. Here's a useful utility tool for orchestral composers, Vienna Symphonic Library's Violin Runs. It also requires the free iLock license manager and it's a great little gem for the tricky task of violin runs. This one gives you pre-recorded runs across an octave and yeah, it's a nice focused little freebie for a very specific task that will be very hard to achieve if you're ever trying to program the MIDI notes yourself. So give this one a go and see if it works for you. Did I miss any? What are your best orchestra sample library freebies that are so good that people could sell them, but they don't because they're either good humans or have a nice marketing strategy, whatever. I love that in the last years, we got so many high quality freebie libraries. So please share your best picks in the comments. Literally comment now, now. Which one do you like most? Which did I miss? Tell me, discuss, compose, get good together and have fun. See ya.